Hey, what's up guys? Azark here. This is a triple cam strike on the map Sovereign, my first triple in Call of Duty Ghosts. Hopefully not the last one either. <laughs> yeah, as you guys know, um, I failed off a couple triple cam strikes. One, actually both on Octane with the AK-12. One where I went uh, three streaks over 22. Uh, only got one cam and then another one where I got a double and then I died on a 20 gun streak to a guy who flanked behind me through the middle of the map because my teammates didn't see him. <laughs> so uh, I've been overdue for a triple and things just happened to, the stars aligned for me in this one. They really, really did. I mean, I get the first Kim and then I work up into the second Kim. I have time for the triple. And I mean, I, I get the most lucky kills in the history of Call of Duty. There's one scenario, which you guys are gonna see later in this gameplay, where I completely completely run out of ammo I don't have anything it's just red letters on my screen that says no ammo a big zero in the bottom right corner and then as I'm shooting the enemy I hear the click of an empty gun click I'm thinking what the fuck am I gonna do I'm almost on a specialist bonus I just pray that this guy doesn't see me so what did I do I ran out really quick with my knife just hoping that he didn't see me and uh, I ended up shanking him. I mean, I don't know what the hell the, the enemy was looking at. I'm pretty surprised that he didn't know I was there considering I, I had uh, honey badger bullets whizzing past his face, killing his teammate. But, uh, you know, hey, I'm not complaining. I ended up getting a triple chem strike out of it. <laughs> and uh, there was another time right after that, actually. And as I'm getting, you know, up to like a 20 gun streak, I, I, climb, up the, uh, I climb up the stairs over on one side of the map I shoot an enemy, and as I'm turning, a fucking enemy, a little split screener, runs past me. And I kind of just panicked and hip fired, and I thought, I think that he thought I was going down the stairs, so he turned around. But actually, when I saw him, my panic reaction was to backpedal. So as I backpedaled, um, he spun around, looked the opposite way, and I just hip fired the hell out of him, I picked up the kill. I mean, those are the kind of things that, you know, like I said, stars had to have been aligned at that moment because normally 95% of the time that type of stuff doesn't happen I mean how many times you know when you're on a streak and you get up get up close to somebody they run up on you do they just shank you or they just spray you down and you don't have a chance to react or or you try to panic spray them and they and they like halo jump you and you you, you use up all your clip ammo and you're stuck with an empty clip and die so I um, mean that's that's usually what happens right anyways this gameplay Beast. I'm going to let you guys watch it. I'm not going to talk the whole 12 minutes because I am uh, going to show the full gameplay. We actually come back to win. I don't know how we were losing. I mean, we had some pretty scrubby teammates. It was just me and my boy SK uh, running running some games during my live stream and ended up getting this gameplay. Bit, by the way, big shout out to my boy SK. Uh, he was helping me play the objective over here. Right here's the first game. But he was helping me play the objective. And honestly, if he wasn't in the game... Um, I can't say that I wouldn't have got a chem strike, but I damn sure wouldn't have got a triple and we probably would have lost the game <laughs> because he was there to fight for B, uh, you know, most of the game. And that really, really did help out. It's always good to have someone who plays the objective on your team. And it's also good to have people who are able to kill on your squad, you know, slayers and whatnot. So with that being said, um, I, I want to briefly talk, touch on the class. This is the same class setup that I use on my AK-12. Uh, what that is, is is the dead eye class and the third specialist unlock you guys have seen this in pretty much every single video in my opinion it's the best setup in the game for going for chem strikes at least in domination okay that doesn't that doesn't mean um, you know tdm and whatnot uh, i've seen some really good tdm setups in particular the one that i just uploaded the pwn stars setup uh, with the marathon that's really really helpful in stuff like tdm and kill confirm because of the way that the spawns are helps you escape a lot of dangerous situations as well uh, but domination, usually the enemies start bunching up into confined areas and you can more easily predict the routes they're going to run because there's also an, an objective involved that they have to run towards if they want to win the game. Otherwise, they're just going to be laying down on their spawn and, um, you know, waiting for you, stuff like that. Uh, but yeah, the Honey Badger, I'm using the Red Dot and the Grip. That's my favorite setup for Honey Badger. Uh, I run this the AK and also the Remington with nearly identical setups. Sometimes what I do is I'll put either blast shield in my starting perks or off the grid in my starting perks and I'll just shuffle around stuff like, you know, slide a hand. I might move slide a hand out 
and uh, move blast shield in or, or whatnot. You know, little small things like that. But this is the core base of my uh, my setup. You know, definitely have dead silence, amplify, stalker. Stalker, no doubt. Stalker is a must. You have to have stalker on ARs. I don't care what anybody says. I don't care how good you think you are. If you don't use stalker on your ARs, you're better with it. Trust me. Um, also, um, like I said, run amplifying dead silence. Those are a must if you plan on being mobile. I mean, if you're sitting back by your team, by the B flag the whole game, you can make a case for not using dead silence. and You can use something more productive like blast shield in there um, as well as sleight of hand. Sleight of hand is very, very helpful. Honey Badger has a pretty quick reload. I don't really think you need sleight of hand. It's not a necessity, but it certainly does help if you're moving um, because this gun does drop people really quick. Um, and uh, when it drops people really quick and you just have that tendency to, to push up and advance and and uh, you start putting yourself in dangerous situations where you need to reload quick. Right here, I actually got lucky. I don't know if you saw that guy, but he was aiming backwards. And um, I don't know how he, I don't know how he knew I was back there. Maybe he saw like a death skull or something pop up. But he was waiting on me to turn that corner. And thank God I had my specialist bonus in my dead eye. That's why I love dead eye. It adds in that nice stopping power where in panic situations where it's you versus somebody else, both you guys are shooting at the same exact time. It gives me that confidence and that little bit of added power in my shot to win the gunfight. Yeah, I'm stoked, guys. I'm so tired, though. It's about 1.30 in, in the morning right now. Um, this is the second video I've uploaded tonight. So if you guys didn't see my last video, it was um, just a nice little class setup, something different for a different style of player. Um, if you don't really like the, the setup that I have here, I would suggest trying that marathon setup. It's really good. And, uh, yeah, that's it, guys. I'm, I'm going to let you guys watch the rest of the video. I'm coming up on... I think my third uh, Kim, my third Kim strike streak. I think I get the double here in a second. I'm gonna wait till I get the double. See where is it? Working my way. I see them spawning A, so checking underneath. Uh, when they have A, by the way, you always want to come around that right side, and if possible, work your way up here. Okay. Always check that little window on the right side of that. Check them spawning here, and you want to get down here because they spawn in this little tunnel area and you always want to keep your ADS you know aim down sight right there in case they pop their little face out Ooh, that guy had some delayed reaction time right there but there's the double I'm gonna let you guys watch the triple leave a comment let me know what you guys thought of this keep beasting I'm out y'all peace Charlie. We got a cap because we're down in points. We're down in points right now. Try to play, try to play it hard, dude. Cause I can, I can get it. I can get it. I'm on like close to a bonus. Securing Bravo. I'm on a bonus. I'm on a bonus. Close to the triple. I'm on a 15. Zombie.
Oh, get off me, son! I'm close. I'm so fucking close to the triple right now. I got it. Triple, triple. On the flags, on the flags. I'm on A, I'm on A. Go to C. Go to C, Shrub. Securing C. Friendly cam strike in. Yeah, hop on C. I'll protect A right now. All points held. Losing B. Friendly cam strike incoming. Woohoo! Let's go! <laughs> you still suck. Oh, they're pissed right now, dude. I'm in Charlie. I got like two guys next to me. I can hear them. I'm losing C. No, no, no. Satcom up link enabled. Losing C. Losing A. Losing A. Let's go! 83 and 7 triple cam! Fucking go! Damn right, dude. Let's go.